This MOOPL series of Texas A&M University is provided through Project Listo. Literacy infused science using technology innovation opportunities. The video series is comprised of experts in the field talking about their research while making important contributions to the art of teaching in the K through 12 environment. Project Listo is funded through a competitive I-3 grant from the U.S. Department of Education investing in innovation program. The Listo project is a collaboration among the Center for Research and Development in Dual Language and Literacy Acquisition, Education Leadership Research Center, and Aggie STEM. Howdy, my name is Kelly Trabing and I'm a 4-8 through eight math science education major at Texas A&M. As a part of Project Listo, I strive to provide you and other educators with a useful and impactful resource to use in your classroom as we aim to integrate math, science, and literacy components to develop students' skills as critical thinkers and problem solvers. The activity we will look at today will deal with balancing chemical equations. This lesson primarily focuses on science content concerning chemical equations, compounds, elements, and classifying chemical equations. However, some math topics are also included, such as coefficients and the distributive property. This activity is a simple lesson that can be given during a class period or over the course of a few classes if you wish to extend it. With this lesson, students will review physical and chemical changes and practice balancing chemical equations and classifying them based on the type of reaction present. A practice worksheet will be provided for students to follow along and work independently as they learn. After the lesson, students should have a basic understanding of balancing chemical equations and classifying them into the five basic categories. This is not an all-inclusive lesson, but a lesson that prepares 8th graders for future upper-level science courses. When giving the lesson, we want to highlight the fact that even though the products contain some of the same elements as the reactants, the reactants completely change during the chemical equation to make new substances. Try and provide visuals for students and examples they could relate the reactions to. Balancing chemical equations will increase students' knowledge and understanding of the chemical level of the world around them, and they will also be introduced to upper-level science vocabulary such as reactants and products that will provide foundational pieces to their education. Elements of algebra such as the distributive property will also be incorporated in the science classroom. I hope this lesson and activity act as useful tools for you in your classroom. Please use the resources in the description below to help you implement this activity.